okay so the next wire splices we will make is the cross joint so it is the combination of two ta plain top joint so the tools we will use is the combination the long nose the side cutter pliers and the wire stripper and we have three wires here okay the main wire and the two top wire will be tapped as a cross joint okay so so the top or uh, the main wire will be stripped at the center okay so use the the long nose pliers and a wire stripper will strip here okay then we'll cut here then the two top wires will be stri stripped about uh, three inches okay mm. So the same also with the second top wire. So now we have here the two top wires and a main wire. So first let's begin at the center. Okay. Then the same application as is done on the plain top joint. So We'll do first going to the left, okay? So if that's the case, it curved. So what you're good going to do is to straight it again, okay? So so that we can it we can hold tightly. So we'll use the long nose pliers then make sure that no gaps between each turn okay then tighten Okay, so we're done with the first uh, top here. Next is the other one. So if we place it here, the other one is on the other side. Okay. So to make it easier, we just simply torn. Okay then wrap it around okay okay
so as you can see not yet tight no? so uh, there are a uh, little bit gaps between each thorn so using the long nose we tight it closely okay then Okay, so here is the finished product. So as you can see, there's a, a quite, uh, shall we say, not so tight. So what we're going to do is to tighten again because uh, those uh, lost contact will create a short circuit or overheat on the wires so we should it tighten okay so until it cannot move so it's very strong so this is our finished product for the cross joint